transparency is vital in the creation of sustainable and resilient supply chains and overall effective corporate governance. It's important to understand the role technology plays in creating and fostering transparency in global supply chains. In multinational corporations, there are two distinct orientations to use technology to create sustainable transparency, control and relational. A control orientation views technology as a tool to gather the ever-increasing levels of sustainability data on supplier practices in an efficient, secure, and progressively automated manner. The primary aim here is to ensure full supplier compliance with internal and external regulatory requirements. The underlying relationship between the corporation and its suppliers is largely a contractual and transactional one. Technology is used to increase the firm's capacity to gather, collate, and analyze ever-increasing volumes of data related to the workings and activities of their suppliers. The power and reach of technology is used to ramp up the quantity, detail, speed, and verifiability of data from suppliers. The electronics industry appears to have advanced this approach most successfully to date. A relational orientation views technology as a tool to build social relations and improve dialogue and collaboration on sustainability throughout the supply chain. The aim is to reduce the need for and burden of gathering and analyzing ever-increasing levels of supply chain data from suppliers while simultaneously improving quality and timeliness of information flows through improved relationships. Once a supplier demonstrates that they are providing the minimal required compliance data, the emphasis shifts to using technology to develop relationships and include the supplier in improvements and mutual innovation. For example, both IKEA and H&M advocate phased planning, support, collaboration, and mutual development with suppliers in the development of their transparency systems. Some companies like Dell and Johnson & Johnson use a relational orientation to spot sustainability trends in process innovation, develop new sustainable materials, and use supplier sustainability knowledge to identify potential new markets. This harnesses sustainability as a competitive advantage. The key differences in the two orientations lies in the mindset of a manager toward development of supply chain sustainability transparency. The control orientation offers improved centralized control, better data security, and the capability to rapidly and efficiently gather fine-grained detail on supplier practices through multiple tiers. A relational orientation creates a longer-term, more developmental-focused view across the network. It can reduce the burden of data gathering and analysis, improve the depth and criticality of data, and bring about improved flexibility and innovation. The key challenge for managers lies in getting the right balance between these dual roles. To learn more, please read Tools and Technologies of Transparency in Sustainable Global Supply Chains by Paul McGrath, Lucy McCarthy, Donna Marshall, and Jakob Brima in California Management Review, Volume 64, Issue 1.